Why shore-based missile is important. The Philippines has one of the longest coastline in the world. Its vulnerability was exposed if one nation comes to invade the country as it has many routes for ships. Modern naval warship can fire missile at long distances and destroy military bases. One key to defend our shore is to acquire shore-base anti-ship missile system. Recently the Philippine government announced its intention to acquire one of the fastest missile in the world the BrahMos anti-ship missile system. The delivery of the Indian-made medium-range ramjet supersonic BrahMos cruise missiles for the Philippine Navy, PNS shore-based anti-ship missile system acquisition project is expected to start within a year's time. A missile battery typically consists of three mobile autonomous launchers with two or three missile tubes each, along with the tracking systems. It is based on the Russian P-800 Onyx cruise missile and other similar sea-skimming Russian cruise missile technology. A medium-range ramjet supersonic cruise missile that can be launched from submarine, ships, aircraft or land. BrahMos has the capability of attacking surface targets by flying as low as 5 meters in altitude and the maximum altitude it can fly is 15,000 meters. It has a diameter of 70 centimeters and a wingspan of 1.7 meters, 197. It can gain a speed of Mach 3.5, and has a maximum range of 650 kilometers. The ship-launched and land-based missiles can carry a 200-kilogram warhead. It has a two-stage propulsion system, with a solid propellant rocket for initial acceleration and a liquid-fueled ramjet responsible for sustained supersonic crews. Air-breathing ramjet propulsion is much more fuel-efficient than rocket propulsion, giving the BrahMos a longer range than a pure rocket-powered missile would achieve. The Department of National Defense DND, on Friday officially signed the contract for the acquisition of Indian-made BrahMos medium-range ramjet supersonic cruise missiles. First delivery is estimated in one year, Department of National Defense DND, Secretary Delphin Lorenzana said in a message to the Philippines news agency over the weekend, when asked for updates on the weapons acquisition. The BrahMos project is worth US$374,962,800, around 19 billion Philippine pesos. The acquisition program for the BrahMos, he said, would push through after the DND and India's Defense Ministry signed on March 2, 2021, the implementing agreement concerning the procurement of defense material and equipment. A missile battery typically consists of three mobile autonomous launchers with two or three missile tubes each, along with the tracking systems. Lorenzana said the Philippine Marine Corps Coastal Defense Regiment will be the primary user of the BrahMos missile system. The acquisition of the Indian-made BrahMos medium-range ramjet supersonic cruise missiles will greatly enhance the Philippine Navy PNS capabilities to defend the country's vast maritime borders.